anymore. So none of those guys have it. So I think it might be fucking RNG, which like sucks even more. It could be on any one of them. I think when I originally did this as well as I like, killed them, and then could just, something like I think if you kill him, you can't pick it up. Maybe. Don't help that there's a fucking hazard, so if I like stay there for too long, I start like losing HP as well, I think. Space monkeys! Little space monkeys! Little little monkeys from space! Ice monkey, monkey spines. Hey, up here. Curious. Gives me a little space one case. Ice question. Must be that one because some shit over here. And I auto saved. Fucking better be more in here, I'll tell you now. Go.
Yes. Look for the stupid monkey. Monkey. He dropped the data module. It's a miracle the data module is still intact. Joker can transmit this info to Alliance Command. Sick. Did it. Fucking save him. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 wait. I think I need to pick it up. Hang on. Wait. I'm confused. Did I get it or not? I would have just thrown a rock at him. Remind me to stay on your good side, Commander. Wait, what? Where did it go? Dude. I'm really con confused. Oh. That's the one that I went into. Right? Wait, what? Yo, now I'm confused. Oh, that's white. It's nice.
Mm. I like it bugged. I like this might have been what happened last time. Like it bugged. Best way to get there. Try and go over the mountain. Right, let's try and go over, shall we, chat? This will work. This will work. Why not? Come on, bye. Come on, bye. Get over the mountain, man. Wait. Oui. I feel like if I go too far in this match, it's going to be like, out of playable area. And I'll cry. such a shit area, like why, why is it here dude? Some metal we've already discovered. Oops. Oh. Back now. Shit my pants. Thought I was stuck. Yeah, let's start uh, doing this, shall we? See if I need to delete any along the way that I can do. And I guess if I do save too often, like obviously often enough that I don't regret everything. If I don't save too often, it should be alright. Please. I beg of the Thank you. some very questionable noises. What's oh, so rocky? What's a fucking marshmallow, bro? Ow. <coughs> I'm digestive in my throat. Just a little bit of digestive crap. Nani. Alright, we need to find a safer room here. Oh. Oh. Um. 
The health hazard is going down. No. Examining the strange Prothean artifact reveals a small, irregular slot on the underside. Remembering the strange trinket you received from the Asari concert on the Citadel, you pull it out and place it into the slot. The ball explodes in a brilliant flash of white light, momentarily blinding and disorienting you. Slowly, your senses return as you awake from a deep sleep. You are alone in the forest, though you are not far from the caves you share with the others of your tribe. There is a play. There is a pain at a small lump in the back of your skull, as if a chip of flint has been forced under the surface of the skin. Leaning on your bone-tipped spear for support, you rise to your feet. A sound draws your attention upwards, where a strange creature hovers high above you. It is unlike the bird you hunt by the lake's edge, and it has no head and no wings. Yet somehow it flies. It is a beast of shining silver, hanging motionless in the sky like a cloud. You sense it is watching you, studying you. Raising a hairy fist, you shake your spear at it in anger, and the creature rises up quickly until it disappears from view. With a satisfied grunt, you make your way back to your caves and the rest of your tribe. You fall into the familiar patterns of life, the hunt for food, the struggle to claim and keep a mate. The battles against other tribes that would claim your territory. Days roll into nights and back into days. Each time you rise from sleep, there is a sensation that you are not alone. That some other is with you, sharing all you see, hear and feel. At these times, your hand goes to the strange lump at the back of your skull and you remember the silver creature in the sky. The air grows colder. Winter falls. You must range farther for food, clutching the first height against you to ward off the chill. It is on one of these long hunts that the strange bird returns. You hear it before you see it. It calls a deafening roar as it descends from above, swooping down on you. A single great eye opens on the underbelly, a glowing red orb. You try to run, but a finger of red light extends from the eye and engulfs you and all goes black again. You wake an instant later to find yourself on Elatania, lying on your back, the Prothean artifact looming above you and damaged and your companion standing over you. They help you to your feet, puzzled. There was a flash of light and you just sort of toppled over, one explains. Are you okay, Shepard? The other asks. You don't answer right away, wondering at the implications of what you have seen. The memory is of a crow magnon hunter, captured by an implanted Brothian data recorder. How long did they study the primitive humans, observing them and analyzing the results at their base on Mars? And what, if any, did they learn from us? I'm fine, you finally reply, realizing this is a mystery you will probably never solve. Forget about it. Mer. Still called anomaly. Okay. If you say so. Alright, where do I want to put this coin? Again. Grass. Oh. Proceed. Okay. How strange. Uh. How very strange. Oh. As long as it doesn't start anything, we should be okay, chat. We should be okay. Listen to your father, chat. He knows best. Light metal reserve, eh? 
Thank you very much. Proof you need your desk. For another mission. I think I remember it. Maybe. Let's go to the Horsehead Nebula. Uh, I guess we're going to Stratus. We. Stranus, right? What one of the missions was Stranus? Hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred percent, hundred percent. Yes. So there should be something there. There has to be something. Double check none of these are landing. Faint trail of radioactive particles, possibly exhaust from the satellite nuclear engine drive, leads towards the nearby planet of Zawin. Now we can land on Zawin. Well done, chat. Proud of you. You did it. You did it. Sometimes you see some shit, don't you? Right. Fuck okay. it. Let's go with the OG squad. Watch! Now in man. Sake, there's a thresher more over here. God damn it. I was hoping they weren't, kid. I was hoping they weren't. Let's fight the thresher more first. Forced. Forced. Anomaly. Ah, let's go have a look at the anomaly, shall we? Ancient degree. Really? Hmm. 
Insignia. Woo. Okay. I want to thrash them all, you little bitch. Because I know he's coming now, so... Good. I'm on my way. On my way. Ow. Fuck, 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 fuck. I was gonna say, fuck. Oh, that was close, man. Very fucking close. Yeah. Eight. <laughs> Eight balls. Ooh, they're next to each other. Gosh. Ooh, Iridium. On my way. 